Welcome to the project demonstration of hybrid power generation system by using the non-renewable and renewable sources. So here non-renewable sources we are using piezoelectric plates. So this uh, plate consists of 9 piezoelectric plates are connected in series and parallel. In that 3 are in series and uh, like that the 3, three sets are in parallel. So we will get maximum of 12 volts and that is the voltage input to the battery uh, for recharging purpose to this charging circuit. So this is the piezo plates and this is for the solar panel charging circuit section and this is for the wind charging circuit so here we are providing the uh, wind power generation to the charging circuit on this one we can see the uh, three uh, like uh, four diodes which are connected in uh, bridge rectifier manner so here generally the rectifier section is to convert the ac to dc but here we have connected that for the rectification purpose of bidirectional rotation of this dynamo so when you rotate, uh, rotate in clockwise direction or counterclockwise direction in both ways we are going to rectify that to the dc pure and that is input to the battery section the output is connected to the battery directly here same manner for the solar panel also but solar panel generated in only one direction but here these four diodes will act as a polarity character if we connect this solar panel in reverse direction then the place may, uh, will be given to the minus of the battery then the solar panel will make a damage in order to protect that we are using these four diodes are like polarity characters if we connect in reverse polarity also the output is going to be plus to plus minus to minus same for the piezoelectric plates also and here from this piezo uh, solar panel charging circuit if you want to charge a battery with 230 volts AC input whenever there is no sunlight is available during night times just connect the 230 volts input to this transformer and uh, disconnect the S from this T or S slot and connect the transformer at this slot right now the battery is charging from the transformer so overall charging time for the battery through the solar or wind or piezo or transformer is 6 hours minimum maximum is 8 hours after that also if the battery is fully charged this charging circuit will block the current flow from the battery to the sources in order to protect the battery or the sources directly and once the battery is fully charged so we are need to convert the dc to ac power supply using this inverter so this is inverter based on the rlc oscillator as you know that oscillator will generate the signal without giving any input signal so we are providing 12 hours dc and this oscillator will provide us the 50 hertz of frequency and that is input to this MOSFETs and from there we are going to get the 12 volts AC with 1 amp current so oscillator will generate low current signal and that will be uh, converted into high current signal with the help of this MOSFETs IRF Z44 so that is we will get the 12 volt 1 amp AC and that will be step up to the 230 volts AC with the help of this step up transformer directly so we can utilize that power so when we place the solar panel under the sunlight, this light will on with high brightness, low lighting, low brightness and a wind directly in reverse direction. There is a wind generator charging circuit, we can see that, so any direction. And piezo is directly input to that signal. So here the battery rating sir. 12 volt 1 amp in this battery pack we can see the 3 4 volt 1 amp batteries are in connected in series so we will get 12 volt 1 amp and wind power generation ratings are 12 volt 20 watts power can be generated means 12 volt 1.5 amps here and this is a 12 volt 5 watt solar panel and piezo also 12 volt 10 watts output directly